Hey Chris, it's Rich from Porsche Greenwich. How you doing? I have the GT3 right here. So here it is. I'll walk around the car and show you all the details on it. So here is the passenger front wheel. Absolutely perfect. And here is the side mirror. The passenger rear wheel and the quarter panel all the way down from the pillar down and let's look at the rear bumper and the wing It's right on the counter. Yeah, I was blocked in. I couldn't do anything. All right, and the wing end plates are in good shape. No issues there. Upper part of the wing. underside with the Porsche emblem. Rear glass is free of any abrasions. Carbon roof. And now we have the driver quarter panel. Driver rear wheel. Side skirt. Driver door is perfect. Side mirror. There's some bug splatters on here. Uh, A-pillar, windshield is free of any marks or abrasions, just some haze on the inside or the outside. Driver fender, headlights perfect, we have the clear markers, necess necessity on any 911 in my opinion, stock ones look god awful. Front bumper, oh, bug splatter, that's on top of the clear bra. Yep, more bug splatters. Passenger headlight. Side marker. And the rest of the passenger fender all looks perfect. The hood is perfect. And now we'll look inside. Sills in really good shape. A little pebble there. Passenger door card looks great. Got the Porsche logo just in case you forget what brand you're driving. There you go.
piping style floor mats, the Porsche logo, dash is perfect. All right, now we're going to go on, on the other side, but uh, it's going to we're going to get a bit of a glare from the back side, so from the from these windows rather. No, not so bad actually. Driver's seat. Looks great. Ah, driver door sill. This typically can get marred up if you're not careful. As you can see, he was careful. He was very careful. This looks great. Driver door panel, driver door card, whatever you like to call it. Great shape. Aluminum pedals. Floor mat. And here you go, 2340 for miles. I see you're getting a little bit of that. Haze. Steering wheel's in great shape. The rim is free of abrasions and cuts and stuff that may happen with rings, etc. That all looks great. Armrest. There you go. So that's the look, behind the scenes look of the GT3. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you have any questions.